trusting everybody. Just your host, we are not in Google. Yeah, let's be clear. I... Oof. About a, uh, a golfing, a golfing pattern. And golfing pattern. You know, before we go there, we don't have to tell you the different types of, uh, you know, sort of familiarize yourself with the different type of uh, golf. How the different, the, 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 the varieties of variations of, uh, variations of the uh, engulfing pattern. So when you see a golfing, you, you will easily, you can easily recognize them. If you are still, Go back to the manual. It's inside the manual. You can get the this in there. Yeah. Then you have you have this pattern like this. Mm -hmm. It could be three, three uh candle covering up just one candle. It could be two, it could be one. It has variation. As long as as long as you have a complete set of uh, uh candles, it is the same, it is the same manner, it's the same uh, uh, pattern. Could bullish or bearish, cover up the, 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 the first one. That's an egoffin. But in the situation when this fails, what happens? In the situation when this fails, what happens? This is worth I me. Mean, like if you get something like this, if you get something like this, if you get something like this, this is a you know, this is a egoffin, right? This is an egoffin. This was an the previous uh the previous uh Bullish and golfing. This is the previous bullish and golfing, right? We have this as previous bullish and golfing mm -hmm. that create that create a support level, create a support level here, right? Now, price came in. Can you see the the three consecutive? Uh, these are the three consecutive uh, bearish candle that runs consecutively. No, no bullish candle in between. As long as you have the first candle, one, two, three, that that runs that that runs down this uh, bullish and goffy, this is that close below it. That's a change in structure. So we now time this as a failed. We time this as a failed as a failed uh, and goffy. So which will be flipped for or a change for sell. So we now say support has become a new resistance. Once this level of support of, uh, of pre previous engulfed pattern has been taken out, we, it now turns a new resistance for selling. To turn the real resistance for selling. So that means this is a broken engulfing or failed engulfing or flipped engulfing, whatever terms you use. So as long as this is broken below, hmm, it's a failed, the engulfing has failed to, to move higher. But the, the, the purpose of this engulfing is to move price, move it higher, right? But it failed at the top. It failed. It failed. So we can we have something like this, that like this, like this. So it failed. It's a fail, it's a failed engulfing pattern. So you now you should not see a retest. After a retest, then you have that this thing. Now, the other part of it is so that means you if you were you 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 were buying. You immediately change to selling once you confirm here. Once you confirm, because this is a, a the previous. This is supposed to be a previous buying buy, buying zone, right? For price to move higher, mm -hmm. but it was taken out. It was taken out. Probably it hit out your stop loss or thereabout. If you are an aggressive, uh, you've been selling aggressively. It hit you out here. But when you see a close below it, you quickly change your direction. Try to cover up your, you know, your small losses and, and still be in profit. So now this is the opposite side of it. This this happens to be what this happens to be a bullish, a, sorry, a, a, a bearish and goffy pattern, right? Which is the purpose ought to have this, the selling down. The selling down that when price come back to it, we want to sell down, right? But price moves higher. Moves higher to break above the resistance created by by the bearish agophy pattern. It breaks and, and close above it. That's a change in structure. So if you wanted to sell here and this has been taken, this zone has been taken out, 
you know, you were supposed to sell inside the zone, right? When price got back into the zone, you were supposed to sell. But it was taken, finally taken out. Instead of it coming down, it will retrace, then push higher. That's the new, that's the new buy. So we now say the support, this resistance has now turned a support. That is the, that is the logic behind the uh, field a uh, golfing pattern. So that's how to identify a, a field a, a, a golfing pattern. And when, when and what happens when a golfing fails? What happens when a golfing fails? It becomes an opposite trade for you. If you have if you were if you were to buy before inside the zone, then the zone is taken is been taken out. So you know you now resolve to sell. You are no longer buying. You, you will sell. So you sell. If you were if you were you were to sell inside a uh, inside a, a golfing zone and it was taken out, mm -hmm. your resolution now would be to do what to buy and not to sell anymore. So when a golfing phase, you still have a trade. So it's not it's not even it's not some a matter of giving up on it. When you fail, you change direction. Change direction. So we use we can. I tell you in the manual that you can use a golfing to map a zone. You can use it to uh, to to confirm a a setup, a setup, a setup. You can use it to to confirm a zone or. Um, I mean, you could to confirm a set a trade setup on the zone. You can use that as an entry confirmation. Is also is, 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 it can also be used to mark a zone. Yeah, to mark a zone. To mark a zone. So let's go back straight to the. So we see different. We will see different. Uh, we see different. Uh, different. Different trade example here. Like for example, this is a, this is um this is a full at seventy five indices. You can see a golfing here. This is a this 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 ought to be. This ought to be a a bull a a a, a bullish and golfy pattern hmm? because it covers this. This is a bullish and golfy pattern. So if you mark up this zone now and it 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 goes up, right? I mean, it 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 it, it moved higher, right? But it turns to be a what? It turns to be a field and golfy pattern because it was taken out here. It was taken out here. It was taken out by this stronger move downward it was taken out now price returned back to it mm -hmm. so this means this creates another another worth another uh uh an above zone again i see it which you were supposed to sell if price come to this place and it takes back downward but it was boy it 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 was broken out too so it's a continuation of this this is just a fake breakout it was a continuation of the probably it's coming from this this uh you know that uh, rejection of, uh, 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 zone you know when you see that longer uh, week it indicates uh, it indicates uh, a hidden a hidden zone or when you see this uh, when you see this uh, he did this a hidden uh, golfing pattern it's inside the manual how do if you if you if you refine it to a, to a lower time frame like one minute or five minutes you will see you will see something like this. We see something like this. Mm -hmm. So this now becomes what it becomes a zone from price tap it to its move higher. So this is exactly what happens here. But it, we it but it was hidden under this particular time frame, which is 15 minutes. So that means if you go, if you go lower, you're able to get that. So let's go straight to the subject matter of, of this section. Now it was taken out, right? It was taken out here. It was taken out. And price come back into the zone. This is a government zone. You know, you are to buy. You are to buy. Our price move up straightly. Then here you can see that here too we have what we have a we have our field another field a government. So you can that you can use a government to trade back to back. You know, 
you can use your Skype, especially if you are an intraday trader. You know, if he fails at the top, hmm? if he fails at the top, I mean, that means he's going to do what? He's going to buy. And he fail at the bottom, he's going to sell. Hmm? Here, he fail at the top here. This is, a, 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 this is supposed to be a selling, right? But it moves higher. Instead of coming down for sell, it moves higher above the above the zone. Hmm? It was broken out here. And price, price came back, came back into the zone and starts moving higher. Hmm? So that's that's a golfing pattern. When it fails, when it fails. Like for example, here too, we have another one here that failed, that failed to move higher. This is supposed to be what supposed to be supposed to be a rally here, right? But we didn't get a rally, rather we get we get a we get a, a failed a failed rally there, right? Price failed to push higher. It came back inside the we make a kind of a kind of a DC, then push back into the into the zone again, but it could not go higher. Could not go higher. So it, it starts it started coming down from this from, from the zone. As long as this place was not taken out, the highest high here was not taken out, that becomes a weak, a weak, a weak, a weak, a weak buy to buyers who ought to buy above this place. Hmm? Because this high, this high is responsible for, for sellers. I mean, for selling to push against buying. If this high, if this this this, this move created a new a new break of market structure like this, hmm? if it created a new break of break of structure like this, that means there's a volume, enough volume or pressure coming to buy. But it didn't. It, but but no no move above this this this, this place. So this is a this now becomes a confirmation. This now becomes a confirmation for what for for a field uh, a field bullish pressure for a field bullish move, right above this place. It now become a pressure. So here you are going to circle out this place as a zone, and then when you see a price coming down, I mean field here, you 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 sell, you sell, you sell. So when a golfing, when a bullish a golfing fails, you sell. When a bearish a golfing fails, you buy. Like what's up here? You buy here. Hmm? Here, right? I see here. So if you trace downward like this, you see a breakout, then a kind of this inside. Yeah. So we have these two as what as another zone that was broken out here. Then price pull back to it. You sell. You sell. So this is your buy, buy zone, buy area, the selling area. Then we have another one here. Can you see this? This is a field, a golfing. It was broken out, then price tapped into the zone. Hmm? This is a field, a golfing. Hmm? Sorry. This is this this is this is a field. It's not failed, you know, it's not failed because that it, it has not been broken below. Yeah, price tap into it. But this is a failed, this is a failed uh, what? This is a failed. Uh, no, that's not failed. This is a failed one. I wanted to, I wanted to do this. I mean to do this. This one, this particular one. Just mark a joy, it goes in, you, you mark it like that. Then so price supposed to go higher. Hmm? Pants for me go here, but it turned downward. Hmm? Got into this place, will not move nowhere anymore. This place, this Segovia zone, push it higher. Push it higher. Push it higher. Push it higher. So that's how that's how to trade. That's what the trade example, how the power, the power of a uh, engulfing in a trade. 
So when a golfing fails, you trade with the opposite side. That's the essence of, of this lecture. You trade it with the other side. So that is the that is the the facts there. So when Goffy fails to hold his zone, hmm? and what happened here? See what happened here. Hmm? See what happened here. And price move downward. Hmm? Price move downward. This is supposed to be a rally, right? It's supposed to be a rally, but it turns to be a sell as this was taken out. This a Goffy pattern was taken out. Then we have another one here too. Mm -hmm. It was broken above mm -hmm. by it coming and created a new, a new, a new. So you can see a counter, uh, a counter move there, a new a golfing uh, zone. Yeah, which which is responsible or sorry, some is responsible for the taking out of this of this support. So we not we 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 longer have we no longer have a. A, a strong high because it has been taken out. It become a weak high. Why did this, this become a? Why it has been taken out here? This now become a new strong high, a new strong high, a new strong high. So as long as price does not move higher to take out this place, so this place it maintain its uh, strong position for sale. It may say its strong position for sale. And uh, you can see here too, here, it was broken out here. It was broken out, then price turned into it. This is a daily chart, also. it's supposed to be daily chart. If you go lower, you see the re retracement, they pull back very well to, to buy into it. So price moved higher. Mm -hmm. And later on, you can see the bounce here, exactly right at the, the resistance area of the DC, mm -hmm. and price bounce higher to this place. The opening of is a opening of a new market. So that is that's how to recognize a golfing. When a golfing fails, mm -hmm. I told you when a golfing, when a, a bearish a golfing fails, when it fails to hold, when it dissolves, fails to hold, price will move and um, break out of it. Then you wait for a retest of it to, to do what to buy. Wait for a retest to buy. We we'll see some trades in there. When bullish and golfing fails, hmm, price break below it, hmm, taking out the DC. So you are, your your action is to wait for a retest into the zone and sell into the new into the new trend. That is that is that for for the introduction. So we we'll quickly go into into some trade. Why I I Yeah, so let's see some 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 life life trading here, right? Now, if we mark this as a golfing zone, right, and we want price, we've marked almost about one, two, three, you know, as our engulfing as our engulfing zone, right? Here, price move is supposed to come in back into into the zone. Price move, it it got retested here. You buy above, got retested. Then let's see what happens at the top of this place. You can imagine this place is a zone, right? It's a zone. It's a zone. This place, can you see it? It's a zone. It's a zone. So it will, it will, it will have. This is a daily chart. It will have a an impact in this place. So we expect price to to start coming down here. And because if you if you look earlier on, the trend is the trend is what the trend is a. Uh, the trend is is down. Hmm? Lower low, lower high, lower low. That's what we have there. That is the trend. The trend has been down. Hmm? It has been down. So price will still maintain that structure until broken 
out until it's taken out. That structure is taken out. So now here we have we have the lower lobe being broken below. Then we have a this a golfing a golfing zone. We have this engulfing zone. Hmm? So this engulfs this this bullish guy. One two engulf this. Then we mark it out as a zone. And price got into it. Mm -hmm. So you mark all these places as we are going to be using for what for sell. So you don't sell until when the last leg of uh, this thing is taken out. This is uh, what this is. Uh, this is a. Uh, so this is a. Uh, a, 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 a bullish a goffy pattern a bullish a goffy pattern because it, it, it covers the body right a bullish a goffy pattern now price pull back into the this thing then it's supposed to go higher but because of this is a, a strong zone right so we expect to sell and not to buy right so now we want to see a field this here it was taken out the bullish and goffy pattern was was nearly going to be broken below. That's what we want to see in order to sell into it, right? Because our initial decision was to sell, right? But you must wait for a change in structure. What is a change in structure when you have something like this? When you have something like this, is a, 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 a bullish and goffy, right? This is a bullish and goffy. Hmm? This, this is this resistance of the area of it. This is the support area of it. The price came down to take it out like this. And went straight into the into the distance. So your own is to do what is to sell. When you see this is a change of structure here, the change of structure is to sell because this support has been broken below. Mm? The 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 zone has been taken out, mm? and the confirmation of the close below it has been taken out. So get that behind your behind your mind. So this is this, this so we 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 want to see the next candlestick kind of to break below this zone. To break below this zone and imagine so it was taken out so this uh, this place was taken out this small uh, golfing pattern was taken out right and price and price do what it was taken out hmm? you can imagine if if you put your you want to sell here you put yours your this in there and um, your stop loss probably around here then your take profits could be could be this place. So you already got in almost about the, how many pips there at the retest of it. The retest of this place here, you got almost about the, you got almost about two hundred fifty one pips in a single day. You got almost about two hundred fifty one pips. Our price continues to moves, taking out, taking out this agave uh, zone. This is another Gobi zone. Hmm? So we want to see this be taken out too. Hmm? Can you see it? So we want to see this be taken out. Let's play it forward. So we want to see it be taken out. So once an engulfing is broken below, it calls for a, a change in its original storyline. It can, it comes it calls for a change. That means you were to sell before. So you can your confirmation is selling will start from here because this place has been broken below. This is an engulfing. It's a bullish engulfing pattern, right? Instead of this this thing to move higher, it start coming downward. So this becomes a strong high. A strong high. So this is our our this. So this is the sell area, the sell point. Then this is your will be your stop loss. Then cover enough pips you are moving down with almost about a with almost about a, about a 378 be secured so that's how to sell it so that's it so that's a change in market structure then it's coming down to this one the next one will be this the, the, the next point of this thing will be this your next target will be this we said this so it's another zoo we want we want this zone to be to be what to be taken because we were already already we were in a bearish 
market structure, right? So we want to see more sell. Continue. You you can move your DC. You can move your DC. Your stop loss. Move your stop loss. Close it. Gap. Let it close. Then you move your stop loss. They break even points. They allow this your profit to be running. You can move it. You can move it. You can move it. Oh, like this place. Secure some business or you exit. If you have like a five trades, you exit like like three out of to you know to hedge your risk. Allow the rest to be run. So you extend your stop to take profits. You can extend your take profits. So you can extend your take profits. Now to the last uh, uh, zone there. So we now play it forward to see. So once you get this, this is a breakout of the structure, right? And price retreats back into it. Price retreats back into into inside the zone. So you are using all this area to sell. To sell. You are using this area to sell. To sell more, to sell newly. Hmm? Put your stop loss there and sell and add more sales. You add more sales. I mean, this was was taken and we got it's reacting to this zone. So, but because we already have another this is that is created here, we already have another this is that is created here. Hmm? We already have another engulfing zone that is created here. It's a, a new zone that's created here. So we want to see price into this zone, then comes down to take out this uh, this this uh, loop. So you set up another, you set up another another this in there. Then your so your set another another cell. Mm -hmm. And price has already moved about uh, in about uh, almost about uh, three hundred three. We have a three hundred three uh, pips in the new in the new in the new cell. Plus the initial one, initial this. Is, you can imagine what you have, what you are securing there. I see that if you look at this place too, it, that's an egofi too. That's an egofi. It's an egofi, mm -hmm. a bullish egofi pattern. A bullish egofi. Mm -hmm. I see it. And price broke and closed below it. So you continue to use that sense, that's that mentality to see a change that uh, this is because this place does not move higher. This place, as long as this place does not move higher. To cover up, to 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 break through this this uh, it, uh, internal higher high. Hmm? As long as it doesn't move higher, so this is the, this is an internal higher high hmm? created by this pullback into the zone. Then this one is the external lower low. So as long as price does not move higher, to take out that uh, this high. Right, so it's an indication that uh, selling, more selling will come to place. It's an indication that more selling will come to place. It's an indication. Hmm? It's an indication that more selling will come to place. So, as long as you continue to see more close below the below a new form, the uh, this thing, you are taking action. You are selling more. You are selling more, and you can imagine. This 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 major one internal uh, this thing was taken out too, but those barriers barriers internal uh, internal uh, engulfing pattern that was that was responsible for the pullback of this structure were taken out. They were taken out. They were being taken out. So you were selling more. You were selling more, and uh, you cover almost about uh, how many pips from here to this place. 
is uh, 700, can you imagine 712 pips? Then in between, you have a new cell, which is from here to the, this space becomes what? Becomes a 359 pips. Can you imagine plus, that's 752. That is, that is huge. That is huge. So you can see the power of a, uh, the power of a golf. No indicator, no this in here. Just, just noting the, 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 the golfing being filled, then take advantage of it. If you see a new, a new strong high, you, you use it as your selling zone. Put your stop loss above, above the zone and sell downward. So we are looking for price to tap into this place and, and now move higher because this is the final, this is here. This is a standard loop. So it has come into the zone. Let's see what happens there. Sanes connection is slow. So you can imagine that. You can imagine you have a, a good a good set into the zone. So there's going to be a bounce of this zone now because this is the last leg. This is an external loop. You no know, price will move from the external high to external loop. Back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, yes. So taking out the internal structural highs and low, which I'll be taking out here. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. There are barriers into selling here. So price has taken out. The first barrier was taken out here. Second barrier was taken out. Third barrier was taken out. Then the this thing was taken out. So the uh, uh, first barrier taken out. Okay, so you quickly do what? You quickly close your your trade. If this place is broken below, if it's broken below, then you, you put up a new cell. Let's see what happens there. Hmm? You can imagine we have a good, another cell here into this zone, because this is what, this is still a, under the field, uh, the other the field engulfing zone. You can see price broke through it with this also together. And we have a pullback into the zone. Mm -hmm. So you sell here again. Then you 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 you, you see you another good sell. You are you going to add more sales, more sales. As you are getting more confirmation. So you are getting more confirmation from that place. You want to see more sell here. Yeah, it's another set. Hmm? Another set. Another set. So the arrow pointing now is sell, sell, sell point, selling point. Yeah, another set that break below this. Thing. So we want to see more more set because this this major uh, key level of that uh, engulfing has been taken out. So this become a major setback. Right for those that ought to buy here. Mm -hmm. If you got this knowledge, you would have saved yourself a lot. Yeah, because this place will push down this. It doesn't allow this to go. It's a strong barrier here. We have one, one here. We have another one here. Mm -hmm. That is that is causing this place to pull down. A lot of strong barrier. Can you see the 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 the, the congestion here? So there's a big congestion there. So. It's causing a traffic. This it doesn't have the power to move, to break through with just a big uh, a volume. So we are saying it's slow, uh, low volume here because of what because of this congestion here, traffic, right? One, two, three. It's facing three major traffic there. So price will not move higher. So we, we call this as a when you have something like this, something like this, like this, that's it. A congestion into the zone, compression mm -hmm. into a particular zone, and you see price moves down. Yeah, so that is that. That's how to that, uh, they, you, you, you want to enter a new cell. You enter a new cell there, enter a new cell, you enter a new cell. But well, that's the zone. This is the zone, this is the upper zone of that field uh, and stuff. So I get it. 
I'm going to put more, more sales. I imagine I'm going to put more sales, and then once price break through it, move your DC, close your, you know, your stop loss. Make it make it tight. So you secure another good, uh, another good uh, stop. That is the 500, 504 pips. 504 pips secured. Mm -hmm. So you have your, so that's the end of this. Thing. Probably you go back and see if there's a other in a buyer time frame or thereabouts. So that's if that's how to buy or how to sell it to a field, a field a bullish end of pattern right from this place. You can see it's right from this place. It's a daily chart right from this place. So that's how to sell. And so let's look at buy. Let's go and look at the example of buy. When next we'll come back, we'll do that.